She grew up on Pechersk, so she knows the secret path behind the president's administration building. It was used as an escape for the wounded during the clashes of 2013. The Maidan doctor, the ancestor of a glorious family, professor and a romantic bard singer whom we met in a small arboretum, the member of Ukrainian parliament, Olha Bohomovitz. Nowadays, for many people in Ukraine, Kyiv has two meanings, meaning power. People associate power with Kyiv, and it is important for me that the power is for people and from people. We stood an eight years battle for this park. It was supposed to be cut down and developed for construction. It had an approved design where the entrance to this 26-story building had to go exactly through Alexander Bahamalek's grave. It had to ruin the Alexander Hospital. And only due to my father's sacrifice of his whole life, health, two fabricated criminal cases against him, did we manage to keep the park for people. And it's always open. All kids, all small dwellers of Pechers walk here. And personally me, I remember this park with no paved walks at all in it, just the fallen leaves, and I loved walking and shuffling through the leaves. For 600 years, the Bogomolets family served people. Everyone created something. Nobody took away or destroyed anything. Alexander Bogomolets planted these trees himself. There are almost 90 unique species of trees here. It's not simply a park, it's an arboretum. Back in those days, the president of the Academy of Science ordered these trees from the whole world to collect here, in this arboretum, on the outskirts of the city. There are several ginkgo trees here. They are the first trees ever existing back from the prehistoric times. The first trees on the earth. This park is so beautiful, but let's move on. This is ginkgo, the tree for long life, and the leaves are here. They are not yellow yet, not falling. They look like butterflies' wings, like hearts. And this one is the black walnut. There are several trees of this kind here. If you peel off the green coat, you'll see a nut inside, but your fingers will be black. Alexander Bahamolets was a genius. He invented many absolutely new things for Ukrainians. He was he was a prominent scholar, he founded pathophysiology, immunology, gerontology, he founded the Academy of Science. He was the first to design the principles of blood preservation, and not just for Ukraine, for the whole world. Alexander wrote that each of us has the potential to live for 120 years. So why don't we then? Because willingly or not, we cut our own lives. These are two oaks, a father and a son. This oak was planted by my great-grandfather Alexander and my granddad, Oleg, planted the other one. So this park has trees of all kinds for power, wisdom, eternity, and they continue growing. In autumn, their leaves fall, yet in spring, they bud back, just like our lives.